Hello, this is Ben Guess here. In the past few months, I've had several requests to document the process I use for amazing, making laser cut items. So in order to do that, I'm going to make a series of short instructional videos. I'm going to show the process of making something simple, uh, something like a small wooden box. This is the first part of the, that series, which deals with the design. So let's get going. I saw a box I liked a couple of weeks ago on, on the internet, um, and I'd like to make something similar. All of my designs start on paper, and I try not to look at other people's stuff while I'm doing the design. I don't want to blatantly rip off other people's designs, but I'm often inspired by their stuff. So I try and keep it in my head and then make my own design based on it. So the box I liked had a, a front that kind of looked like this. It was kind of square. But it also had little legs at the bottom. So let's make these little legs and they're kind of rounded and like that. All right, so that would be the front of the box. And then the side also had little legs. So the box was raised off the floor. So it looks somewhat like that. And at the back of the side, there was kind of like this round part that was kind of like where a hinge could be for the lid. Let's draw that on the other side too, with a small round part, and then there was the lid. So it kind of looked like this. Now I'm going to want the lid to, I want a little hole in the front here of the box so that the lid can actually protrude a little bit. and It'll be kind of round at the front here, just to give it a little place where where you can kind of slip your finger and lift it up. So and then the lid, and here there was a hinge for the lid. So it'll look something like, like this. Now, in order for the bottom of the box to stay in, there was a little cutout here, and a little cutout on the front. So let's let's put things like that. And in order for the sides to fit together. Uh, we'll put one little curve like that, and another one on this side. And then at the back, we'll have the same type of thing. And that's the basic design of the box that I want to make. Um, so there's a front, a back, two sides, a bottom, and a lid. And uh, how big should this box be? Well, I can kind of just measure it with my fingers. How, how big do I think I want this box? So I think the lid should be, I don't know, about this size. So let's put that way on the white. Let's grab my pen, make a mark in one corner. And I say, yeah, about this size here would be a, a decent size. So let's put a mark in the other corner. And then we can uh, just make some lines. And we can measure things and say, okay, well, I want, looks like I want my box. I think, uh, I, think I find it a little bit too, uh, too wide or too deep. Let's make it like that. Yeah, okay, so this is about three inches by about five inches. So three by five. Doesn't have to be exact, but it gives me a, a good idea. Sorry about the cut in the video. Uh, I got a little distracted by something. Uh, so, all right, so my video cut out and now I'm back. Um, so I've made my dimensions five by three. I've decided that the front is five. The side is three, and I think the, the height is about three as well. So I think the side will be somewhat square. So now I have all my dimensions for my box. I have a general idea of how I'm going to do it. Uh, and that's pretty much it for, the, uh, for this video, for the part one of the series. Uh, part two will deal with uh, how to design this in SketchUp. So join me for the next part. Thanks. Bye.